Good morning, or depending on when you're watching this, good afternoon, good evening, or good night. My name's Ross, and as always, told out of voice the radio, so today we need to have a chat about Pikachu with grey felt hat. Because that promo came out yesterday, and there seems to be a lot of misconceptions swirling around regarding this product, and there seem to be a bunch of people who are getting ripped off. And that, ladies and gentlemen is where I come in. I need to tell you all about this. I need to tell you what the deal is, how it's available, and how you can avoid getting ripped off. Because frankly, if you're nice enough to spend a part of your day watching my videos, then I think it's, it, you know, only right for me to come along and try and stop you guys getting ripped off. Because as it stands at the moment, what's going on is a bunch of people are massively, massively, massively overpaying for this promo. Like, ridiculously so. If we go over on eBay right now and have a look at what's going on with this promo, I mean, on the UK site right now for eBay, we've got a couple of listings for £400. £400! That's absurd, ladies and gentlemen. That is absolutely absurd. Now, one of them's actually got seven watches. One of them's charging 75p for postage. Like, if you're going to try and rip me off for £400 for a promo card, which is really not that rare, and is worth nothing along those lines, I mean, come on, ladies and gentlemen. You just pay the postage, would you? That's just mean. And I know at this stage you might be going, wassy, wassy, wassy. Look, mate, yeah, fine, they're listing it for £400. They can list it for whatever they want. Nobody's actually paying this. Well, yeah, they are. The last couple have sold over on eBay in the UK. We've got 350 quid and a 345 best offer accepted. Fun little side note. Most of the people who are listing these are actually using images that were taken by like the lovely Sarah B. Joe or images that other people who were at the event with me last night were taking that they haven't even got the card. They just know how easy it's going to be to get, and now they're trying to rip you off with it, which is clearly really sad, ladies and gentlemen, and these people really need to, well, sort it out. Because you shouldn't be paying 350 quid for this card. The idea of paying 350 quid for this card right now is absolutely patently absurd. And it is actually worse than that, incidentally. A lot have sold on eBay since last night. Like a weirdly large amount have sold on eBay since last night. The listings go on and on and on and on and on, even though these people don't have the cards in hand. The only people that really have the cards in hand are the people like myself who were at the event last night. And I can assure you we are not selling those cards because we were gifted them and told we're not allowed to sell them. So the people who are selling those cards are people that don't have them right now. I mean, the first two sales are a really stark one for me. First one sold for 30 quid. Honestly, probably about a fair price for the promo. And the second one was best offer accepted on a grand. And I know people are trying to get these quick and they're trying to rush ahead and all of that, and that's lovely. But no, ladies and gentlemen, no. It is absolutely not worth it. Now, here's a silly thing, right? If you're going to spend 350 quid for this promo, and just to be clear, you should not be spending 350 quid on this promo, okay? Cannot stress that enough. We'll talk about why in a minute. What about the screen promos? Because this was the last museum collaboration they did. You can buy a graded Psyduck, a 9 for 260 quid. And this Psyduck is gone. It's not coming back anytime soon. And this is a PSA 9. And I guarantee you, and feel free to come and mock me on my future videos if I'm wrong, the Psyduck is going to be worth a lot more than this Pikachu of a grey felt hat in the long run. Or you can go and get yourself the Rowlet, a raw version for 115 quid. Like, these screen promos were a promotion that happened years, I think it's 2018. They are gone. They've been gone for a long time. You could only get them in Japan. They're actually quite a pain to get hold of nowadays. And these you can pick up for considerably less than what people are asking 
for Pikachu with a grey felt hat over on eBay. And the good news is, the value of Pikachu with grey felt hat is about to plummet. It is going to plummet dramatically because, and here's a secret, although I did tell you this in a video yesterday, this card is not that rare. This card is really not that rare at all. I mean, one thing you can do is you can go to the Van Gogh Museum in Amsterdam and collect, uh, complete a treasure hunt and then go and pick this up. And you know what's a little bit messed up, ladies and gentlemen? It is literally, okay, not from every country in the world, obviously, right? But from the UK, it is literally cheaper to fly to Amsterdam and book a hotel for the night and go to the Van Gogh Museum than it is to pick up these cards on eBay. Literally cheaper to go to Amsterdam and pick them up in person. That's weird, right, ladies and gentlemen? That is weird. Don't do it. Now, here's the deal. That's one of the things you can do. And here's where some of the confusion has come in. Because there is some confusion coming in here. Over on the Van Gogh Museum website, they have said that the only place to get this is in the Van Gogh Museum. And that's not actually true, but this is something that is being shared around. And you can understand why it's being shared around, because it literally says it on the Van Gogh Museum website, but, but it's not actually true. Says it right here on the website, the promo cards will only be available in the Netherlands between the 28th of September 2023 and the 7th of January 2024 by completing a Pokemon adventure at the Van Gogh Museum. The promo cards are subject to availability. And technically, that is actually correct. They are only available in the Netherlands from the Van Gogh Museum. But you see, ladies and gentlemen, we saw this banner on the Pokemon Center yesterday, which says Pokemon Center Van Gogh Museum coming soon. There is going to be a range of products sold on the Pokemon Center, and when you buy them, you are going to get the promo. And I've seen a lot of disinformation being spread around about this promotion, but as I've said a couple of times, I was at the opening last night. I was there in the building. I went to people who work for the Pokemon company who are involved in this and I asked them flat out, is there more than one promo card? And I was told, no, it is only the Pikachu. I asked if it was the same promo card being given out in the shop in the museum and on the Pokemon Center online. And obviously it is because again, there is only one promo card. And yeah, so this is fine. It's been given out, and it's not live yet as I record this. It's, I'm assuming today, that's the rumours I'm hearing. Although, to be clear, I didn't get official confirmation it's going to be today, but I am hearing rumours that it is going to be later today. But regardless, it's going to be soon, and I tweeted out a bunch of the merch, which is going to be available for, for the trading card game, and it's stunning, ladies and gentlemen. It's absolutely stunning. There are a bunch of playmats which are going to be available including, well, check check out this one. Check out the Soso -so one. It's Soso -so with Munchlax and Snorlax. It's amazing. We've got these three deck boxes and sleeves. All six are available as sleeves, incidentally. I have now seen all six in person. I can confirm all six artworks are available as sleeves. And this is kind of wonderful. And then we've got things like the Pikachu and Eevee side by side on a nice little playmat. It is redonkulous. Oh, and this playmat, which shows all six of the artworks. There is a bunch more stuff which is going to be available on the Pokemon Center. The point is, you can get the promo card there. And you don't have to spend like 350 quid. And the value of this card, I guarantee you, is going to plummet over the next couple of days. It is going to absolutely plummet over the next couple of days. And my advice to you, if you want to buy this, because I know some of you live in the US, Canada, or the UK. And that means you can just buy this stuff off the Pokemon Center, which is amazing. And I know that some of you don't live in the Pokemon Center areas. Your Canada, your UK, and your US. I understand that. So... 
you're not going to be able to just go and order these online like some other people. And, and I apologize for that. But the fact that it's available at the museum and the fact that it is available online at the Pokemon Center basically means there is like no chance that this can hold any real value because it's too available and too out there. So even if you are forced to buy this card on the reseller market, it is going to be okay. Do not pay free $400 for this card like some people are doing. Don't do it, ladies and gentlemen. It's a terrible, 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 terrible idea. Right, that's what you need to know. And now it's over to you guys. Tell me which of the sleeves and all you like. Tell me if you're picking up the card. Tell me if you're going to be able to get to the Van Gogh Museum. Tell me anything you want to tell me in the comment section. Go nuts. Be nice. And then make sure you like this video. Subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter at the Wasi. That's where we talk about Pokemon and a whole bunch of other fun stuff. And please do consider checking out patreon.com slash ptcgradio, where you can support the channel, get some bonus podcasts and all kinds of fun things. But by far the most important thing as always, look after yourselves till next time, would ya? Thank you very much for watching. My name's Ross and you've been watching PTCG Radio.